Yeah. Pocos más. ¿De Cuba son ustedes? Sí. Es que acaban de cruzar un grupo aquí. Ahí están, son tres que llegaron aquí. Gracias a Dios, mira ahí está la Guardia Nacional. I make content on social media, particularly TikTok, all in Spanish, talking about immigration uh, for those who are already here in the U.S. and for those who one day want to come here to the U.S. Así la situación actual en la frontera. The quick format of the videos where you're able to watch a TikTok in 10 seconds and then watch another one is really convenient for immigrants, especially if you're on the move, uh, you're going through Mexico or through Central America, you don't have access to a television. So what do you do? You go on your phone, you watch a 10 second, 15 second TikTok, you learn about the news and then you keep on moving. Como pueden ver, un grupo enorme de personas, incluyendo a varios niños. Somos seguidores de él, por medio del teléfono de las noticias. Las noticias. Ah, pues él nos está informando cómo está el paso del río, cuando crece, cuando baja, cómo está la migra y lo que sufrimos nosotros los migrantes. So there's a lot of desperation. Many people are trying to flee. If they're not already here, they're trying to find a way to get here. And what I try to do is just tell them the reality that there's a legal process behind it, that once you get released, you have to go to your courts, how the court system works, all that kind of information, which is really lacking when you see someone on social media say, the border's open, everybody come. And my mentality is if I'm here, my family was able to immigrate, today I'm a US citizen. Why can't others have that same opportunity? I've been blessed in this country to be able to go to school. Now I'm in law school, I've been able to work, I've been able to contribute. You know, I want people to have the same opportunities that I've had, but I want them also to be informed because I want people at the end of the day to be safe, to be secure, and um, to not make decisions uh, that could potentially put their lives in danger. Pues ahí se van, mi gente. 